you've got to develop this understanding yourself. Um, there's a, in the Discord called, this is a public channel, Pro Analysis. If you don't want to review profiles on your own, click on that channel and you'll see that I've reviewed a ton for you, okay? And here you can see December 26th, we reviewed a Brimstone Fracture VOD of Xander. And you can just go watch that. And then you don't even have to go study pros on your own. You can study them like in a guided method where you just watch this VOD and you learn alongside the talking banana. Please consider supporting me if you enjoy the content. The best way to support me is with a Discord subscription at discord.gg slash wuhujin. I'm currently learning Initiator and tier three Discord subscribers have access to daily private ranked streams. Just want your VOD reviewed? VOD reviews are free of charge and happen live on my stream. Join the Discord and read the FAQ for exact instructions on recording and submitting VODs. Thank you for the support and enjoy the video. Brimstone Fracture. Pog. My best map. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Right here. Purple VCT knife. Ghost? You gotta go frenzy, man. You gotta go frenzy. It's very good, trust me. Smoke's down. Bro, get out of here. It's not A. Bro, get out of here. It's not A. Bro, get out of here. It's not A. <laughs> I would have been so far gone. You have no idea. Different. Frenzy because of map reagent? Uh, because frenzy. Frenzy on pistols, like the secret sauce. Chat. You should just all buy frenzies on pistols. One enemy. Nice. Just nice. position nice. accordingly. Yeah, so I don't care about the actual result. I care that we're at 135. We haven't seen anything A and we're not knife out running B. Because uh, we should be. And then we'd have to come back against this team and we'd slow down for the rest of the game against this team. Um, but we got to play greedier. But now moving forward, I play slower against this team because of the way they just played pistol. Don't get too don't get too focused on the result because otherwise you're thinking, oh, I played slow and I got paid off for it. Playing slow is good um, and it's not. Won't that smoke delay their entry onto site? In my experience, when I throw that smoke A main on Fracture, they push it very quickly, as far as I know. Uh, generally on pistol round, teams just rush. Like if you, even against the smoke, they're gonna like Skybird um, or in a flash, generally. In a lower rank, you feel like it kills and makes them play slow. It, do you have a Fracture VOD? Because most of the time, teams rush on pistol in every ELO. At any time I point this out, people are like, not in my ELO. And they never have proof. And I've reviewed so many VODs that I know, yes, in your ELO. But the one time there's an exception, everyone just copes hard. And it's like, no, that happens every time, Wuhu Jin. Uh, I would double up with Jet. She's pushing drop. What are we doing, Sight? Holy shit, she even took the orb. Why are we still A? Hey, man. You supersonic legend doesn't happen to your ELO. <laughs> this team is ridiculously slow. What the hell? I'm having an aneurysm. When you rotated there, I would have had gun out looking A main. I'm really sus of these guys. I'm really sus. Yeah, I'm trying to use that. Look at the timer. If you throw that smoke and they uh, wait it out, 14 seconds left on the clock, quite chillin'. 30 seconds left. Enemy We're chillin' anyways. Bro, these attackers are slow, but like in a bad way. <laughs> One enemy remaining. These guys are. Oh my goodness. What the? F okay, so we smoked five seconds into the round. We smoked here, even though they did not rush A main. Then we breach stun here, and then we used Stim Beacon to open the door. <laughs> Clear. 
Okay, okay. I love the double flank. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Your breach sold this so hard. So what I'm doing here, by the way, when my breach starts shooting like this at their backs, and this is just solo queue instinct, I'm walking this way and tucking. I know they got flanked, but we, we don't have that info at this time. So at the, I'm walking here tucking, and I'm just hiding. Because these guys are going to turn around and fight my completely moronic breach. They're going to kill him, and they're going to think flank clear. And then you will flank and they'll all die. You're going to bait this guy because he just tried to cash out on what? In spawn, in spawn, in spawn. Another one behind you. In spawn. Feels bad. Yeah, and then we'll die to that extra flanker. <laughs> this guy starts the round knife out in the middle of sight for four seconds. Oh, what are we doing? I'm down. I'm down. Amateur. Break the wall. Br br break the wall. Oh, he's slow. Dusted. On tower. Dusted. On tower. Just watch the next round. Just Go watch the up. next round. I didn't see anything. Okay. Nice looking, man. 65 on rain. Okay, 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 okay. Carl. Carl. How much high elo gameplay do you watch? Give me a give me a estimate and be um conservative with your estimate please like whatever you estimate it should be that number or more zero okay well then we're gonna have some homework carl because right now it looks like you don't know how people play the game and now you're kind of backing me up there you're essentially you're playing this very poorly and it's because you're trying to reinvent the wheel you're basically trying to figure out how to play on your own when there's already fabulous players at the game so generally what people do on this map on brimstone when they're playing a main is they want to incentivize the enemy team to burn utility to contest this banana shaped space a main like that early smoke you threw was great pistol round any of these smokes are good you throw one of these smokes and it makes them burn utility to take the initial space and sometimes you can even fight them still like you give a breach flash through this door. You can fight here and you, you can like really contest this space before you allow them to advance. And what that does is it makes their A hit a lot weaker because now they're they're down a man. They're down a flash They're They've used utility to take this initial space. So now they have less utility to take A. And this is this is not like a pattern where you can be like, OK, now I don't need to watch pros and I'll just do that dish. And I'll just do that B main because that's not how this game works. The game is very complicated and the geometry can heavily affect whether space can be contested or not. So for example, B, you don't really need to follow this concept uh, because it's harder for them to come out this way than it is for them to come out this way. And it's harder for you to peek this way than it is for you to peek this way. And the only way you'd learn these things quickly is by watching high radiant players and just being like, where do they play? How do they play Brimstone? And then you'd see uh, on B, they like playing back dice. They like playing in sight. They like jump spotting. They like mollying B main to split the enemies up. And I know this because I've written it down in my notebook called Wuhujin Top 100. Back when I was studying controller players and I studied Xander Fracture Brimstone and he jump spotted B main and he mollied when they tried to come out. A main, however, he gets much more aggressive. And sometimes uh, players like Zoms, they'll smoke like right away. They'll run out. They'll even pre-molly expecting to rush. And it's like interesting how they contest these spaces so differently when they look so similar. And you've got to develop this understanding yourself. Um, there's a, in the Discord called 
This is a public channel, Pro Analysis. If you don't want to review profiles on your own, click on that channel and you'll see that I've reviewed a ton for you, okay? And here you can see December 26th, we reviewed a Brimstone Fracture VOD of Xander. And you can just go watch that. And then you don't even have to go study pros on your own. You can study them like in a guided method where you just watch this VOD and you learn alongside the talking banana. I add another one to this uh, channel once a week. I started uploading them to YouTube recently, but there's a lot more on the Discord. So um, if you're watching this on YouTube or on Twitch and you really liked the pro analysis on YouTube, you should join the Discord because there's a lot more in here. This is a huge issue. We've got. Your playbook is just so questionable. I just don't see people playing like this. What are we doing? You don't know what you're doing. You're just playing a shooting game and you're just shooting them. There's no strategy here. You want to fight it. That's true, right? Launching smoke. Like I can pretty much figure out exactly what you're gonna do at this point. I've downloaded you. You're gonna smoke when you think they're pushing you and you're just gonna try and shoot them. And that's, as far as I can tell, the depth at which you're playing the game, which is of course gonna hold us back. Drop, drop. Get out of my way. And bam, we fight them. There was no plan to use our molly, no plan to use teammate utility, no plan to use our ult. Because we don't know how to use that stuff contextually because we haven't watched high level gameplay where's the pro analysis channel oh i'm about to teach you guys the discord life hack uh hit control k on discord and just type pro dash analysis control k is the discord search button you can use that for anything you can control k and type a username and it'll bring you their dms with that person okay okay um i'm gonna quickly give you like you need to go watch pros but uh you mollied a bit too early me, you bro, want a molly uh, to split them up, like after one of them ran out of that smoke. Hit me. Ooh. 30 seconds left. Bro, you're holding W at them while they peek you. Let me explain why this is bad. Do I need to explain why this is bad? You know why it's bad? Okay, perfect. Yeah, we should just be chilling. Uh, I'd be crouch holding or um, AD. This is an easy VOD. You've essentially, you've got a very good baseline. Some players, I don't know what differentiates, but they get to these like really high line ranks um, just by playing the game. And that's you right now. You've kind of just been playing the game. And oh my God. Yeah. You, whew, whew. It's a lot of games. Okay. Notes. Focus points. General do, do gunfight. Hygiene is pretty bad. You sprayed nearly every fight I've watched. I want good gunfight hygiene in 80% of your fights. You clearly have not studied slash watched much high level gameplay. If our goal is to rank up, this is untenable. Next VOD, be prepared for me to grill you on which pros you've studied on this map. And I will be asking for the notes you took while studying those pros. These are tough notes. These are tough notes, but uh, this is what you need. This is what's holding you back. If you want to rank up very quickly, uh, it doesn't have to be the same map, Carl. It can be any map, but it needs to be a map where you've got notes. This is what's holding you back. Your mindset, your approach. You've played 900 games and you haven't watched high level gameplay. There's like um, a huge imbalance in the way that we're approaching the game. We need to we need to understand how the game's played at a higher level. So I need you to take some notes. You can uh, feel free to watch my pro analysis VODs for this. They are very good and free for all to view on my Discord.